hey guys welcome back to my channel um i don't know which video i'm gonna put up first either this one or another video either or it's gonna be similar makeup because i'm filming two um videos in the same day i just want to kill two birds with one stone i like to do that especially when i don't know it takes me so much to be motivated to do a tutorial when i do it i love it then i just life happens so today i'm going to do a haul video for you guys this is my first time i'm so excited i've gotten so much makeup over the past couple of a week or so i would say and i just wanted to come to you guys and show it to you and show you what's popular on the market what i like what i don't like just makeup so this is the bag's makeup i got it's so much makeup but also I just recently had their 21 day sale and oh, i love it like everything is cut in half like everything you want that's full price is half price and like that's the best thing that you could ever get. Like, I don't know. I got two of the Tarte eyeliners. One I already started using, you can see. Um, they're $10. Normally this by itself is $22. So to get two for 20, it's just like a major steal. It's this liner tip, just to show you guys, it's so thin, like the easiest cat eye like. And I feel like felt tips are so much easier to manage than like liquid or gel. And that's how I learned how to start doing eyeliner. So definitely got this. This is a major steal. With the Shape Tape um, Concealer. This is not sold at Sephora. So it sucks. But this tape is, this concealer is so full coverage. Like the Dopa applicator is huge. Like it just fits underneath your eyes so good only thing that sucks they don't have like a lot of colors which i wish they did have i mean i just made it with the color oh yeah i love 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 this shape tape like it's a good concealer i wouldn't recommend to wear it every day because it's so cool color coverage and the price point so i don't want to face it on every day but um i do love this i do pair this with my um urban decay all-nighter foundation these two together your makeup is not going anywhere and it's this on fleek all night like you're gonna be the baddest when you walk in a club with this stuff on i'm just saying i'm just saying love it i got some nyx butter gloss this is in the shade madeline i've seen another youtuber use this lip gloss and it's like more of a peaky like it's more of a pinky color and that's what i like more than like brown glosses because like i have praline and at first i thought i liked it but i really don't like it darker glosses on darker people would pull more purple for some reason i feel like so i'm not a purple type of girl so can't do that oh my gosh oh something i was so excited to get do you see this like do you see this do you know what this is also sells the Kali Bar Bible Palettes and I don't know if it's because like it got so popular and they were just like I don't know but I was super excited to get this palette like I'm opening it for the first time for you live on camera like I even waited like a lot. and then for me to walk into Ulta today and buying all this other stuff and I'm like looking around and I feel like God wanted me to see this palette because he knew how much I wanted it and like it was there so beautiful oh my gosh this is what it looks like it's so warm um what actually sold me on getting this the girl who was there was like I have it and she was she's black but she wasn't like fine skin complexion she was like more of a lighter skin complexion I would say but she's like I have it I love it She's like the highlighter shades are amazing and I knew it and like it's amazing. Definitely a keeper like I just love this palette. I can't wait to try it out like thumbs this video up if you want to see me do a first impression video with all the new stuff and I definitely will do 
a first impression is using this palette like oh my gosh like I can't stop looking at it like I'm truly obsessed like Urban Decay the Slick Setting Spray I have this I had the travel size of this when I first started to get into makeup and I really did love it like I loved it and I can't take credit I didn't buy all this stuff my boyfriend was just like I appreciate you let's go shopping shout out to him love him so he took me to Sephora and there was a couple things that I really really wanted and I was like some stuff I wasn't like I wasn't going to buy for myself so I'm like let me let him buy it for me and I wouldn't feel as guilty or whatever but the first thing I got was the Sephora Bright Future Serum Bright Future Gel Serum yeah um I see the Glam Twins use, the, use these concealers um, I got my in Dolce de Leche. I think that's one of the shades they use. They also use a lighter shade, but I have a perfect fine highlighter that I'm still need to use. So I'm not really trying to look for a lighter concealer. Like this was when I swatched it, it was really good. The formula was really good when I swatched it. It was like not too drying. It was moisturizing, but not too moisturizing to the point where I thought it was going to crease on me. So I don't know. I haven't tried it on yet. Like it's still in the packaging and everything. So. I'm looking forward to trying that. This is the this is the Marc Jacobs um, lip gloss. I guess they're called. There's no really oh high shine lip gloss lacquer lip gloss, and it's in the color Pretty Thing. I seen makeup Shayla use this lip gloss a couple months ago, and she used it with the Chai Smashback Smashbox lipstick. I got the lipstick. I love the lipstick and I'm so excited to put this together. I used to also see that um, Jaclyn Hill had this lip gloss and uh, when I see it on lighter people I'm like I don't know how it's going to look on me because like on um, deeper complexion it's like what looks good on one person does not always look good on the other person simply because of the skin tone. So I got this bad boy and it's, it's like $26, $28. That's why I really didn't want to buy it for myself. And then when my boyfriend was like, you can get what you want. I was like, oh, well, let me ball out and get this gloss before I never get it. This is what it looks like. It's super cute. I want to swatch it for you guys, but I feel like my lights are too bright. And that's why you can't see color. And like I said earlier today, like, I'm really into these baby pink colors. I don't know if it's going to be winter time. I'm just feeling for it or I don't know I just that's what I'm into right at this moment things will change like I was so into brown lipstick lastly what I got from Sephora was this Anastasia, Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipstick and the color potion all this stuff that I brought is like it's a win-win like I've been wanting this lipstick for so long but I don't know when I really wanted it. It was the summertime. I'm like, I'm not about to walk around with a super deep lipstick color like this. So I'll just wait till the fall. And then, like I said, since he was taking me shopping, I was like, no better time than now to get my lipstick. So I'm just opening it for the first time. Like, oh, it's so dark. So. potion oh it's so dark I can't wait to wear it like this is going to be a go-to for the winter and fall like I already know like I already know um one of my favorite lipsticks and my first lipstick I ever got was it's called some purple mm, I love that color I used it to the very end and then like when I love things, I try to try new things to get away from it. So hopefully when I try this color, it's a win and I love it. And then I can replace it. But if not, like, smoke purple is my heart because that's my first lipstick color. And I just love it. Like, just love it. Also, I got the new Anastasia Beverly Hills um, stick foundations. So this is what it looks like. Um... You get a good amount, I would say. It's only $25, so the price point is phenomenal. I'm 
want to swatch my shade to see if you can even see it like it's like dead on I feel like oh here it is it's like spot one like it's really a good shade um it's perfect now this tan is going to go away it's in the summertime so hopefully everything still looks the same but I got mine in the shade chestnut so far I like it to not if you get this do not use it with a beauty blender because it does not it doesn't move it doesn't blend i've seen another youtuber tutorial using the stick foundation and she was like at first when i tried it with the beauty blender she didn't like it and i was like i was on my way on my way to support to return this life now but then i was just like well let me try it with a brush because not everything works with a sponge so i tried to brush and i guess i was just in a mood where i was just using beauty blenders for everything so that's why I wanted to use my beauty blender, but it didn't work. But it doesn't matter. Like, I use my, my Morphe M439 brush. Blends out everything like a dream. Like, yes, definitely love this. Spot one complexion. And then lastly, do you know this box is? Oh, I'm stupid, y'all. Um, this is the Kylie Cosmetics box. Um, just recently she had free shipping for all US shipping. So I ran to the computer to get this. Like I was so excited. Um, and it came, this little note, of course, for her signature, like it always comes with it. It says, my love, let your light shine through. Enjoy my new lip gloss, XO Kylie. I didn't get a new lip gloss. I got an old one, but maybe it's just automatic, whatever. Don't say K. And unbox it. This is what the packaging looks like. I'm sure everybody knows what they look like at this point. This smells like cake. It's so amazing. Like I love it. Like love, 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 love. Like, and I use it the first day and was like, Ew, this is not gonna work for me. At the top, that's so CK. And I'm like, ew. I like powder donut looks. And then I use one of my favorite lip liners, which is the NYX. Um, I think it's this nutmeg, if I'm not mistaken. So, yes, nutmeg. So, what I did first, I put the lipstick on that you don't want to use a lot of this lipstick, and then I put this lip liner around it i filled in my lips a little bit and perfect new love it I'm not gonna return this love it it's my best friend for the new for the winter i love nudes so i was feeling this and i did try it um i also got the pencil in true brown k <gasps> i just like low-key ruined it Anyway, I got the lip liner in True Brown K. It's a True Brown. Also, I got another. I got, what color is this? I got the gloss and literally, oh, I seen makeup Shayla wear this and I was just like, oh, I need it. So that's it for this huge makeup haul. Thank you all for watching and supporting. Um, if you have any of the products, please let me know in the description down below. If you like them, if you hate them, if you return them. Um, let me also know which is your month's favorite. Um, what you like for, I guess I would say September because we're just getting into October. And I don't know when this video is going to be up, so we'll say September. Um, leave it in the comments down below other videos that you would like to see. I know I still have to do an eyeliner tutorial i know i know i'm trying i just like i said uh let me know if there's any videos you want me to see if you like this video let me know thumbs this video up and as always don't forget to like comment and subscribe thank you so much for supporting me i hope you enjoyed this haul and i'll see you guys next time bye